static load tests require experienced personnel along with significant equipment and instrumentation. As part of our static load testing services, GRL can furnish the load test beam, hydraulic jack and pump, and all ancillary instrumentation. Required test components include the reference beams, bearing plate, hydraulic jack, steel plates, load cell, spherical bearing plate, support brackets, displacement indicators, the load test beam, and pressure gauges and transducers. Depending upon the project requirements, a static axial compressive load test, a static axial tensile load test, or a lateral load test may be performed. In a basic compressive or tensile load test, only the applied load and foundation movement are recorded. An instrumented axial load test may be desired to delineate the resistance provided from each layer in the subsurface stratigraphy. An instrumented lateral load test may be desired to better assess lateral load response. Once the static axial compressive test system is arranged, axial compressive load is incrementally increased and the associated foundation head movement is recorded. After exceeding the required load or movement, the load is incrementally reduced and the associated foundation head movement recorded. If additional load transfer instrumentation was included in the test, the calculated internal force versus elevation can be presented for each load increment. Once the static axial tensile test system is arranged, axial tension load is incrementally increased and the associated foundation head movement is recorded. After exceeding the required load or movement, the load is incrementally reduced and the associated foundation head movement again recorded. Lateral load tests can be performed by pushing against a fixed reaction, pushing two foundations apart, or pulling two foundations together. Once the lateral load test system is arranged, lateral load is incrementally increased and the associated foundation head movement is recorded. After exceeding the required load or movement, the load is incrementally reduced and the associated foundation head movement again recorded. If additional instrumentation is included, the deflected foundation shape versus depth as a function of the applied lateral load can be presented. For additional information, contact info at grlengineers.com.